Check your rooster tails. Huh? Who did your hair this morning? My hair? <laughs> yeah, who did that? I've been busy making holsters. Hey guys! Steven and Amy and David here with ProTech. And today we're going to talk about the Alaskan. And we're going to go over how to adjust it once you get it. And we're going to talk about the two different types of Alaskans that you can buy. Isn't that something? It is yes. a fact. So we try to make them with enough straps on them so that if you've got little pecs like me or big pecs like David, they'll fit. Right, Amy? <laughs> yeah. So, so, yeah. So let's come up here. David, why don't you model for me first? Come on up here to the, come a little closer. We're getting used to this new camera. Okay. So the first model of Alaskan we have is the one where you've got just the gun. Just the gun, no retention hardware. And uh, those are nice because the gun itself will just lay flat up against your chest. Got the leather backer that the, that the full, full coverage Kydex shell is attached to. And then the strap system. Um, Amy, you're next. So Amy comes over here. She's got the same thing as David. And each strap system, like I say, we put a lot of excess strap. I've actually run this through this buckle and then back through. And so if you get this, you'll want to cut that off and then fuse it with a lighter when you're done. But then here on the strap system as well, we've got these buckles, these sliding buckles. Would you hold your <laughs> hair out of the way? Gosh. <laughs> these buckles slide. Once you get, your, once you get the middle strap adjusted, you want to take this buckle right here and slide it over to the side like that. So this, this chest strap comes up and over down at a diagonal so that when you're wearing it, it's pulling it up and into your shoulder and this strap isn't going to want to slide down over your shoulder because it's constantly being pulled that way. And then, um, and there's a buckle up here for that too. So you pull that through and run it through the buckle and you can trim it off and fuse it with a lighter when you're done. So everybody, let's show them how to take them off really quick. On three, we're going we're gonna to take them off in unison. Here we go. All right, ready? One, two, three. Yeah, you never showed me how to do it. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you're stuck. <laughs> There you right. go, it's off. Yes. <laughs> and then to put them on, put them back on. Quick, one, two, three. Lost my strap. There we are. So, these are nice for when you're wearing coveralls or a big coat or you're out hunting or you want to obviously open carry around people. And that's where this model comes into play. This model is the one that comes with retention. It's got a level two spring-loaded hood on it, so right like this. Boom. Hopefully, they'll be able to see that in proper lighting on the camera. But you can see here we've actually got laminated leather to build that surface up so that this, this hard plastic level two retention, hardware doesn't dig into your chest. That goes right there and you can push and slide around on it and it's comfortable. But without that laminated leather piece, oh man, that would be very uncomfortable, wouldn't it? So that's our latest and greatest design there. And all of our buckles, the 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 way we connect to the to the leather, all that's custom cut on our laser. We designed the slider and the, the loops and all that. And uh, it's pretty cool, pretty cool stuff. Um, these buckles we buy off the shelf, but the rest of the hardware we design here in house. So, and everything's triple stitched too. You can notice there's triple stitching on each each web portion. We've also got some elastic built into each one on the uh, on the part that goes around your body, so that you don't have to cinch it up super tight to have that snug feel. Um, 
And then they're all set up so that if it gets hit, if it gets hit, it doesn't, it doesn't hurt. So if you fall on it or whatever, it's going to disperse the pressure and not hurt your pecs. Right, David and Amy? Your pecs feel Roger, great. Roger. Yes. So isn't that nice? <laughs> um, so order your Alaskan today from our website. Um, a little bit about the materials, same materials on all of our other rigs. These are called Kybrids. That's Kybrid with a K, not Hybrid with an H. Because we use Kydex all the way around the gun. And we use Kydex what? 100. Kydex 100. Because <laughs> Kydex 100 is how many percent stronger? A billion. 40 percent! That's oh. right, Amy. 40 percent <laughs> stronger than regular Kydex. Because guess what? Regular Kydex kind of sucks when it gets stepped on or smashed or bent or what have you. Sometimes it can crack prematurely and it won't take nearly as much of a beating as Kydex. 100. 100 will! That's right! Man, isn't that nice? So, um, and then we mount that shell to a grade A premium leather backer and everything flexes and will mold around your body and it's just super comfy. So if you're looking for a premium no holds barred chest rig for your gun then there's a possibility that you might not have to look any further than right here at ProTech. I found one now. Yeah, you, you, you found one on your chest right now. So did you David. Isn't that nice? Let's all do a draw on three. Point right over the camera. One, two, three. There it is. Let's do it again. Now, if you're holding a revolver, you should do a, a weaver grip. You don't want to do a thumbs forward grip because you'll toast your tootsie <laughs> out there at the end of the cylinder. Okay, here we go. <laughs> don't pull before you hit the hood like this. Here we go. So, like that. Because if you pull into the hood, it won't disengage. So you've got to disengage it before you pull. Isn't that something? Hmm. We're going to leave that yeah. leave that little educational piece in there. So what I mean is, you've got to hit the thumb lever before you pull the gun out. Because if you don't, and you pull, and then you hit the thumb lever, it ain't going to work. So, one of the nice things about that is for gun grabs, the bear will not take your gun away. The bear can't take your gun away if he's pulling on it, right? Yeah. So, now, if you pull on it, if you pull on it, hit the lever, and it doesn't come out and you push the gun back in, then it'll come, then it'll release. But just make sure when you grab the gun, if you get the one with the level 2 retention, that you disengage the thumb release first, the rotating retention hook, on a serious note. This has been a pretty serious video, don't you think? Yep. I feel serious. Yeah, very serious. I feel so. super serious. <laughs> so we're going to photograph these, and then we're going to get them in the mail to our customers because they need their chest rigs. So you guys stay safe out there. And what, what extra words do you guys have for them? Buy one today. Buy one today. Buy two today. Buy two today. By three a day. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> Stay safe, guys, and we'll see you next time.